Hey Duke, peace coming back at you with an Andre Kopitar PC. This is for um, a little thing that another YouTuber is doing. It's called PC Showdown. But anyways, um, here we go. We'll get into it. Um, got the series, whatever base series two. Uh, now let's get into the hits. So we got Bailey's Betty's jersey. Oh, by the way, that's not my only Kopitar base card. I have tons of them. Um, Kopitar full off winning combos. Kopitar Froloff Tundra Tandems. Fab 4 Fabrics of Kopitar, Froloff, Nagy, and Blake. Over to 100. Four different colors on that. Pretty cool. Even though they're not current kings. Um, quad Jersey from Black Diamond. Sorry. Um, Dominion Jersey. 99, I believe. Yeah, 99. Sweet Beginnings, Sweet Shot, Rookie Jersey. And a Rookie Materials from... 0607 series 2. Okay, now we'll get on to the, some of the nicer stuff, getting a little bit better now. Got a triple jersey with um, Brown and Dowdy, my three favorite players on the Kings, number to 50. I do collect all Kings, but these, this is just my Kopitar stuff. Um, most of it is Kopitar, as you can see, there's some other stuff in the background. Um, Ultimate Debut Threads Duel, number to 150. Sign of the Times Duel with Froloff. Cool card. There's some I noticed on this card right there. I don't you can't really tell, but there's like a sticker. Like on the on old cards the numbering used to be like almost on like not really on a sticker, but it kind of somewhat is on a sticker. Um I can't find any cards like that, but it has like a sticker there, but there's no like right there. You can kind of see the corner of it. Right there. It's um, like they would they were gonna put numbering on it and then they didn't. I know they never put numbering on these, but it's just something weird I spotted a few days ago. Sorry, I keep knocking the camera. First, and then now we getting into the higher end um, artifacts. Eleven, twelve, emerald patch jersey with that really sick patch right there, number to sixty-five. Um, I'm looking for the spectrum dual patch. I know. Um, Habs fan seven seven one has it, but he's not looking to get rid of it. Um, let me just take this off; it's kind of scratched up. A authentic fabrics, authentic fabrics triple patch with Dowdy and Brown. That's the Kopitar patch, not the best, but it's better than Dowdy in my opinion. Uh, it has a lot of stitching in it, and then the Brown is just insane. It's numbered to fifteen. That's from ten eleven SP game used. I was trying to get the one from this year, but it's a pretty pricey card. That one I got for. Like, under 30 bucks. This one I also got for under 30 bucks. Surprisingly, um, I got an insane deal on it. I offered, and the guy took it. I couldn't believe it. Um, but yeah, it's all the King's Men patch autograph. Not even the Prime. It's the patch version, right there. Really, really, really nice card. Number to 10, right there. Um, the sticker is is a. I mean, the autograph is on a sticker, but usually his autographs um, go off the sticker, like. As you can see in this card, how much bigger the autograph is. Um, well, that is from 0708, but he usually goes off the sticker, and this one's perfectly on the sticker, so that's really awesome. <coughs> Sorry. Um, now we got how many? We got five cards left. Um, we got an ultimate dual patch auto, number to 25, as you can see up there. On card auto, that's a that's like the best autograph of him I have. The next one coming is probably the second best. Um, really nice card there. Love that card. And my only limited logos of him. It's not the best patch in the world, but at least it's not a one color. Uh, limited logos from 0809. Number to 50. And that's like my second best auto of him. Um, so yeah, it's a really nice card. The next card is probably not as good as this. I like this one better than the next card, but you'll see. Um, some of people's opinions, the next card might be better. Or some, it might not be as good as the limited logos, but I think I'd rather have the logos in this next one, but it is a really nice card, very low numbered. From 1112 Certified Mirror Emerald Autograph of Andre Kopitar. That's short printed to only five. So that's a really, really nice card. Um, yeah, as I said, I probably like this one better, just because it's from a higher end product, but this one is still very cool. Two more left. Um, this autograph of him is really cool. Um, it's this is his signature signature patches from his rookie year. 
Um, one of my first cards of him, got it for Christmas. Uh, it's a signature patches from his rookie year with that insane patch on it. That gives it a lot more value, I think, somewhere to 75. So that's my second best card in the PC. You might, you, you were probably thinking that this is not even as good as the limited logos or the, or even this one maybe, but um, surprisingly it goes for a lot of money. The one color patch went for 60, the two color patch went for 80, and I just can't, I don't know what this would go for. I'd say at least 100. Um, I got that emerald autograph a long time ago when he wasn't that hot, like halfway through the season I got it, maybe even before that, and I got it for really cheap. Um, yeah, the last card, um, I really like this card. I got it from Kluchin Charo's eBay. It's from 0910 Superlative. I'll just show you the bottom. Superlative nameplate of On J. Kopitar. Just a really, really nice card. I really love that card. Numbered one of one. So yeah, that is my Kopitar PC showcase. I um, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, and peace out.